Hello guys. Today I'm going to show you how to install my NFL 2018 rosters and team mod for Axis Football 2018. The first thing you're going to do is you are going to you're going to of course load up the page that has the mod, and then you are going to click on the mod location folder to download it, which it will open in your respective browser. Um, and I highly re recommend you download each file separately. Don't uh, select all them because sometimes there can be some complications that happens. And I find it a little bit easier when you don't do that. Then there's less chances for bugs. And then you just wait a few seconds until the you know mod is finished, of course. Then close out your browser. Open up your downloads folder where you installed the mod, which I have put it right here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to gra grab both of these, hit cut, and I'm going to go to my my Axis Football 18 folder, which I will go through my install games on Axis or on Steam. I'll right click, go to Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files, and I'll go to my Mods folder. And now right here, I will paste my uh, folders right here. But that's not it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do the player portraits one. So I'm going to unzip this, but do not hit extract to player portraits. And by the way, I am using 7-zip, a free program. Uh, I don't really know how to use WinRAR because I just use 7-zip because it's built right in. Um, when, once you download it from the web, if you just Google 7-zip, and it, but you're going to hit extract here. And then you're going to say yes to all. So basically, it, that, it's just putting it into the player. Uh, portraits folder. You're gonna let that do its thing, and I'm gonna go ahead and do the team mods ones the same way. Seven zip, extract, extract here, and let these programs run. Now we just have the team mods one wait, waiting to be finished. Before you delete these folders down here, well, you don't necessarily have to delete them, but I always do that just to clean stuff up. So just verify the team mods folders. You should have all these files here uh, in your team mods folder. If you do, then you're good to go. And then, what you, and, then what, and then after that, just delete the remainder files, of course, just the ones that you downloaded. Close this out. And then launch the game. And once we're in game, give it a few seconds. Um, I will show you where to go to activate the mod. You're gonna go to options. You're gonna and then you're gonna go to the options screen, and then you're gonna go to mods. And you're gonna un you're gonna check the use mods box, and then uncheck the mod. So basically, like this, and then. You're going to have, the only thing left checked will be use mods. Then you're going to hit back. You're going to close the game out. Exit the game. And then once it fin finishes closing out on Steam, relaunch it. And just wait for it to load up, of course. And then you, you, and you, can go, and then you go to Expedition and choose whatever mode you want. I'm going to go to Spectate for my purpose. And all the teams, 36 teams, will be here, right here in this mod. And as a bonus perk, this mod does work franchise. So I will show you how that works as well. Go to franchise. I'm going to delete this. So I can show you. You're going to delete that. Or you're not going to delete it. I'm going to show you on mine. Then you create a team. I'm, uh, and I'm and I, just to show you that how franchise works. I can just select, select a team, Buffalo, and then there you go. Play some franchise. Now this mod is still heavily a work in progress, so all the teams are in. Some logos might be missing. Some uniforms might not be lining up. 
But as I said, this is I'm the only one working on this mod, and I'm spending as much time as I can on it, and whenever I have free time. And um, I hope you enjoyed the mod. If you need any help, just post on my discussion page for this mod, and I will gladly help you when I'm available when we're both available. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this video.